Ginger is undeniably important in every household. Here in Jankoba, it is cultivated by everybody. In its production to sale, there are challenges. We are here to interact with farmers on the numerous challenges they are facing in the cultivation of ginger. Jankoba, a community in the Achimangwabiaja district, has a farmer population of about 29,000, representing 52% females and 48 males. The community is regarded as the largest production hub of ginger, with production estimated at 260 metric tons yearly. In 2020, government commissioned a ginger factory under its 1D1F initiative for farmers here to preserve the chunk of ginger produced. The factory now sits abandoned and covered in weeds. Ezekiel Opon, a ginger farmer at Jankoba, has been in the farming business for a decade now. The 26-year-old points out some significant losses the community is making due to the inability to make the factory operational. The prices we get from buyers are poor because we do not have any processing factory over here. If government opens up the factory for us, we would be gaining enough. Farmers in the community say his lack of a factory to help preserve the ginger is hampering production and their financial gains. Kofi Asari, who has been into the supply of ginger, is worried. Say, I can't hear 100 cities here. Obama, I said, I'm 80 cities. I'm 70 cities. And I'm saying, oh, my children are here in the Now, this, I can't hear you. I can't hear you. And the, yes, I'm saying, I said, I'm saying, People will sell it to buy it at cheaper prices because there is no factory to buy it from. We plead with government to factor a fixed price just like he has done with cocoa farmers. District Chief Executive Officer Michael Amoa says government is aware of the plight of these farmers. He attributes the delay in reopening the factory for use to the current economic challenges. He pleads with government to institute a fixed price policy for farmers and consumers. The factory is in place. You, you may have visited the place and seen for yourself. But what is left is power. The equipment, everything have been procured. What is left is the uh, hooking the facility to the national grid. And that is what has been awarded on contract. So just last week, the contractors were here to take the measurement and everything. So hopefully, by the next time that you visit, the extension of the power to the facility would have been started. So this is the newly established Jankoba Ginger Factory through government's public-private partnership. The district chief executive officer says it is at a state of electrification. Now the factory in no time will start its operation for ginger processing. Reporting for Joy News, Nana Pwache Dankwa Yadom.